Well, hello there. Come on in. I'm Chris Brown. I'm your humble chimney sweep. I was just going over your chimney inspection report, but now that you're here, make yourself comfortable. Let's go over it together, shall we? Okay, now let's take a look at the inspection report and see how it reads out. This is a generic report. This is exactly what you will get, only your information obviously will be filled into all these blanks. The upper right hand corner of the report is the legend. Each one of these initials pertain to something. A is consistent with the age of the chimney. B, C comments below. C, repairs needed. D, need further evaluation or E, not applicable. And they're placed into the boxes next to the parts of the chimney that can be easily identified in this diagram. And then of course you'll find my comments here below. Now let's take a look at your particular, your personal report. So stay with me. Hey Bryce, it was uh, great to meet you out at the house today. Uh, beautiful house, nice location too, by the way. Let's go up on top. Let's see what's going on up here. So she has a, a, a stainless steel cap keeping the birds, squirrels, rain out of the chimney. Uh, but also what we could see up here is a lot of cracks in the crown. No doubt this crown is leaking water into the body of the chimney and it obviously needs to be re-poured. Uh, flashing around the chimney looks good, not having any problems with that. Flue system itself, not having any issues in here at all. Took several pictures in, di in different locations as we scanned the chimney. Inside, we've got a working set of uh, vented gas logs. Uh, the damper block is uh, a blocking here. It actually needs to be attached to the handle right in this location. So it needs to be relocated. But right now the pilot is off, the gas is off to the unit, so uh, it's a non-issue. But once the pilot is relit, by uh, chances are it'll be the Piedmont gas uh, folks that'll come out and relight it for you. They need to resecure the block in the proper location. By the way, blocks are required in the state of North Carolina for your protection. These blocks mean that you can't close the damper, uh, let's say in the summertime, and, op and forget to open it in the uh, fall and fire up the logs and fill the house up with something you wouldn't see or smell. You know, unlike a wood-burning fireplace where you'd get smoke coming back in and say, aha, forgot to open that damper. We're talking about carbon monoxide, which is something you can't see or smell. State of North Carolina wants uh, that damper left open for your protection. This is the ball valve, service valve. It's in the proper location, not having any problems with that. Folks have questions for me, give me a call, 704-526-6348. You can text me on that number, or you can email me at chris at affordablesweep.com. Thanks.